please tell me what the hell is your maroon nude matchmaking slinky mind fucking thinking? Tell your heart to stop screaming my name. Shoot it up into your mind's eye instead. Dull my scent. Stamp me out, down, away from all these games you thought you could play. Keeping up with my face. Replaced by your hate. Fuck you and your flowers. I have a whole little black book of my own. Petals pressed and tucked away. But springtime is coming and soon everything that's been kept dead and gone will rebloom. Good luck in your efforts to catch up. I'm stuck here. And I'm keeping your memories alive too. For example, today I'm going to reconsider the simplest form of our relationship. It is residual, and pretty dirty, and a bit wrinkled and compressed, but the rest is second guess from that time, that area of space where it was ripped off of you in the first place. How funny that I'm literally reminiscing and writing a poem about the tattered remains of a dress of yours with flowers on it that I once kept tied around my wrist. This scrap of fabric sounds a lot like where we've been. I know you look for me there. I think it's inconvenient and a little heart-wringing that this is what you have brought us to. Do you know just how counteractive it feels to restrain the urges to shatter the backbones of any positive recollections, still preserved and collected, kept close from the time you tried to steal them all away from me? That is all there is, and I want to purge it, eradicate us both. Shove it to the forefront and rip it apart. To shreds. Like you did to me. So that I don't have to hear your stupid fucking laugh in my dreams anymore. I'm caught here, somewhere between high hindsight and your desistance. Dislocated. What an uncomfortable repositioning. I guess there's nothing to be done but to tie this floral strip around my tiny little wrist. And sit here and wait for you to kill yourself. Shoot it all up high and dry and away from you. I'm watching you try to dissolve all of the memories that are pumping through your skin. Alive. You know, you could just give them to me instead. I will eat it all and swallow it and keep it there contained in my void. Where it won't reach anyone ever again. <laughs>